Okay, we're in uh, Scotland at a golf course, Cameron House, and today I'm going to unbox my Brewdog and Friends July box. I've been waiting to do this, so let's see what we got. Okay. Friends. Let's see what they have in these box. Um, well, okay, there we have it. We have. Well, we have some interesting cans this time around. Huh? There's the booklet. So, they have. Let's go through these. The first one is Marshmallow Laser Quest. Interesting can. It's six uh, percent marshmallow and pineapple hazy IPA. A hazy IPA unpacks sweet tropical fruit aromas, bursting with pineapple, candied fruit, sherbet, marshmallow notes, heading towards a sweet finish. That I would like to taste. Next one. Is Pilsner is called Naples Staple. It's an Italian style Pilsner dry hopped with shaz, spalts, hops for maximum aroma, spicy and floral and herby. Now how much is that? That is also quite strong, that's a 5.2. Okay that would be quite tasty as well. Uh, next one. Oh, wow, this is an interesting one. This, by the name of it, looks Japanese. Matsuki. Matsurika. Matsurika is uh, Matsurika. one of the highlights of Japanese cuisine. The jasmine petals called Matsurika in Japan add these petals to the recipe of Pilsner to bring delicate floor notes to aroma palette. So basically, it's a Pils with jasmine. <laughs> Looks very nice. That's also 5% ABV. Nice. Last but not least. Oops, yep, my, it's probably my favourite one this one's going to be. Tropical and Citrusy, the Draft House India Parallel. Let's see what they say about that. That is 5.7%, so they're all quite strong in this box today, this week, this month. And what does it say about this one? This is the... Tropical, fruit, apricot, orange, red, grapefruit, papaya, and big notes of... Ooh, Vezzini pine and hints of black tea. And this is a brew dog draft house in a small batch. Hmm, interesting. Right, that's the yeah, end of this video. Uh, I'm looking forward to tasting these and I will do some tastings in the next videos. I think I might try the Marsh 101 first. That seems quite tasty. It's a hazy IPA. Bye for now.